Hello, I'd like to show you a new feature we've incorporated into 4.1, um, a feature which allows you to compare channels and periods. Um, I'll use the demo account so you can work along with this uh, video. Um, as always, what I do is I let the uh, screen fill the browser window by putting the toolbar at the top. I'm going to select a period, um, oh, let's see, uh, I want to uh, show a few weeks of data, so I'll go from the 29th, that'll include the last Sunday in a week. I'm going to back it up to, uh, say, the 7th. So if we just let that data load, here we go. Um, this is an office block um, where we've been working with the energy manager to try and uh, reduce consumption. What you can see here is um, the five working days, the weekend, five working days, weekend, five working days, weekend. And I hope you can see there's been a considerable amount of reduction over those three weeks. But let's actually look at this and uh, do a comparison. For example, let's compare the month of each of these weeks. So I'll go to the whole admin building here and I open up the uh, the channel just as before in 4.1 so we actually can um, see each of the intervals. There's the 7th, 8th, 9th, 10th and you can see what they each used. I'll select the 7th, that's that first graph, and what it will do is it will actually show me the day. If I then actually um, scroll down to the next Monday which is the 15th and select that as well and I do that by holding the control key and uh, clicking on it you'll see um, it's already beginning to change and again if I go to the next Monday uh, which I believe is the 22nd six days between them two three four five six yeah the 22nd again I hold the control key and click on that chat on that line we will see the last Monday and here you can see therefore the 7th the 15th the 27th and see the overall daily reduction um, if that's not graphic enough, another way you can show it is you could actually um, say, uh, let's actually leave this data in uh, a weekly format. So I set the interval to weeks, and we should see each of the weeks now. Just take a second for the data to load. Uh, we're going to get um, a little bit of data here for this week, that partial week, the 28th. That's just one day of a week there, so we won't take much notice of that. Um, Again, what I'll do is I'll open the account there, so we've opened the admin account, and we can see three weeks here, uh, the 7th, 14th, 21. Again, if I select the first one, and it will show me the seven days in the week. So there they are, the two weekends. Uh, then I'll, by holding the control key, I select the second week. And you can see there's been a reduction and finally I'll add the third week in. Takes a little bit of time. There you go. You can see how the client's managed over the thing. I mean, quite a huge reduction on these Mondays, big on the Tuesday, even big on the Wednesday. I mean, he's now actually even got the weekend loads to come down. In fact, we've reduced, redu we've reduced consumption from about 2,600 kilowatt hours per week down to 1,300 over half the load. And this graph, I hope you can see, illustrates that. And as I said, you can actually compare channels in exactly the same way. Going back to the um, top admin view, we can compare, for example, let's compare the first floor. Here's the first floor with the uh, second floor again. Okay. Hold the control key, select second, and there's the uh, comparing the two floors. So you can see, in fact, the first floor hasn't really changed, but the second floor really made a big reduction. So I hope that new feature helps. Thank you very much.